Hi, Tom Burden here for West Marine. Today we're headed for the Moss Landing Boat Works where I'm going to take on one of the big jobs for every boat owner, putting on a new coat of anti-fouling paint. We're going to be trying a new sort of paint this year called Pettit Hydrocoat Eco. This paint's special for a couple of reasons, and I'll tell you why, but first we're going to go over to the boat yard and we're going to go pull the boat. Out goes the travel lift, up goes the boat. What is special about this paint? Two things. First, it does not use copper as a biocide, but instead uses echinea, a non-metal product that keeps weed, slime, and barnacles from growing on your boat. Second, it is water-based. You'll see why that's important when I start painting. The yard power washes the hull to clean off the heavy growth. The environmental rules they have to follow are pretty strict. All the old paint and vegetation must be captured so it doesn't flow into the bay and that's a great thing because our local harbor is in a marine sanctuary full of sea otters, dolphins, and humpback whales. Now we'll get the boat properly supported on the boat stands. Taping off the waterline with 3M 2090 blue painter's tape. Now it's time to sand with 80 grit. Be sure to wear protective gear because anti-fouling paint is toxic. I have rented a sander with a vacuum from the yard for an inexpensive rake. Vacuum sanding is required to keep the dust off you and out of the bay. When I finish sanding, I'll wipe down the hull with Pettit 120 brushing thinner for a solvent wash to remove contaminants that might keep the paint from sticking to the surface. Ready to start painting. I'm using our C-Fit Deluxe Paint Tray Kit, which has everything I need. What you get is a metal paint tray. You get a nine inch roller frame. You get a nine inch, three eighths inch cap roller sleeve. You get a fuller brush, a paint suit, two dust masks, and a pair of polyethylene gloves from West Point. Now I'm brushing Hydrocoat Eco onto the rudder. I've created my own custom light blue by mixing equal amounts of their blue and white colors, one gallon of each for this 40 foot boat. Notice that I'm not wearing an organic vapor mask like I would have to do with a solvent based paint. This paint has virtually no smell. If you've put solvent based paint on your boat, you know that the whole boat yard smells like your paint. Not the case with this water based paint. I do wear Buffalo SMS coveralls, a head sock, and protective shoe covers. And when I'm painting an overhead area, I wear 3M impact safety goggles and a particulate respirator. You don't want to get this stuff on your skin, eyes, clothes, or hair. We came back the next day after the paint dried and had the boatyard workers move the supports. I'll paint the bottom of the keel with the boat hanging from the travel lift. Haul out time is the easiest time to take care of other assorted jobs like waxing the hull and putting your new hailing port on the transom. I had a couple helpers who buffed out the top sides and applied a good coat of West Marine Advanced Pace Wax. The boat looks great. Well, we're done and it's time for splashdown. This has been a lot of work as haul outs always are, but a water-based paint like Hydrocoat Eco makes the work and cleanup a lot easier. It's also good to know that the paint we're using won't leave a buildup of heavy metals in the marina. Thanks to Moss Landing Boatworks for their excellent service and for letting us turn their yard into a movie set. Fast forward about four months and the diving service gave me a great report on how well the paint is doing. Pettit Hydrocoat Eco is a good choice for boaters who are looking for a more environmentally friendly anti-fouling paint. It's also a great choice for you if you keep your boat in a location where copper paints are not allowed. If you are looking for a paint that uses cuprous oxide as the biocide, you can select from two other choices, Pettit's Hydrocoat or our West Marine Bottom Shield, both of which use water-based technology which makes them easier to use and simpler to clean up. We hope you've enjoyed this West Advisor. Pettit Hydrocoat Eco and all the other tools and equipment used in this video are available online at westmarine.com and at our stores nationwide. See you on the water.